Hey guys, welcome to EMCR Rosenberg. It's kind of busy, you'll hear a gas plane flying by. It's gonna be a busy day because it's nice and sunny, not too much wind. Um, something special today, a little flight review of this free wing 64 millimeter EDF Stinger. Um, and it's kind of weird, right? Because it's been out for like three years now. So why would you want to do a flight review? Well, basically two reasons. One, it's awesome. <laughs> Um, it's awesome if, like me, you didn't have any experience with EDFs before. Uh, so I think it's the perfect entry model for EDF flying. Um, and then two, uh, because Motion RC just came to Europe, right? Somewhere in June they opened shop, I think, here in the Netherlands for Europe. So basically a lot of these models are kind of new to us. Um, now, um, this one isn't really exclusive to free wing because hobby king makes a version 2 don't know how that flies and this is actually the um, high performance version so the original one had a five blade uh, fan with a 30 amp speed controller and you would fly it on 3s this one has a 12 blade fan i don't know if you can see it from there it has a 12 blade fan um, 40 amp hobby wing speed controller and it takes 4s and i'm flying it with these Admiral 2200s. Why? Because I, I still had a lot of uh, 2200 graphenes for my EF Extra and they don't fit. So no standardization there. You see on the inside, this one just barely fits. The other 4S batteries I had, they were too thick. And then there's one thing I would advise everyone maybe to do because this Stinger has one um, really weak point actually which is the tail because in the cutout for the servos that really is a weak point so and I did a little dirty job but I put a little bit of carbon in here uh, and that works and another tip um, they have these really nice hinges in here they have these really nice hinges in here yeah it's it's been through a lot already but these hinges they will come loose a little bit so just put a bit of CA in that uh, when you're uh, assembling it, so they'll stay nice and tight. All right, let's do a little flight. It's gonna be a little flight because it's an EDF. That's the part that bothers me about EDFs. I love to fly this, but it's like three minutes and 30 seconds of fun, and then it's over. But um, here we go, little flight. Well, so you can see this battery just barely fits in there so if you use this 2200 you don't have to worry about the CG because it only goes in one way and it's balanced <laughs> I was gonna show you a uh, rather flat spin. There we go up nice and high. Let's put it into a spin. First, it needs a rotation, and then you can give up a dale run, and then it goes like this. That's cool. <laughs> it's pretty decent speed. Put in a little bit of trim, and I love to fly this fast and low. It has a nice whoosh to it. All right, let's get it dirty low. <laughs> Sorry about the sun, guys. Just trying to keep the plane out. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> oh, it is cool. It actually. Yeah, my son says it goes in really fast. Yeah, eh? Wow! <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you can do some decent aerobatics with it. Uh, 
but for me the most fun it is to just go low and dirty <laughs> and then go just so for a little knife edge oh yeah you have to hold it it does have some coupling but right. loop right in front and then some little tumbling action I don't give it all the, the aileron in the world so it does some kind of nice funny I was going to show you a uh, rather flat spin. There we go up nice and high. Let's put it into a spin. First it needs a rotation and then you can give up the dail run and then it goes like this. That's cool. <laughs> That was a good one. Is to go for the gap in the trees. As you'll see, there's a little gap in those trees. <laughs> <laughs> uh, a lot of fun this little one
landing. Does carry a bit of speed. Glides nicely actually. Doesn't stall violently or whatever. And with some wet grass you can actually get it into the pits. <laughs> so there you go. 64 mil EDF Stinger. Um, I almost take it to the field every day I come flying, you know, just a couple of flights in between. And it actually goes very well with the Hawk and the, um, what are the other guys flying? The Avanti, you know, we, we get to do nice formations together. So that's pretty cool. Now, if you like this video, please do subscribe and um, tell me what you think of this. And I'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye-bye.